is down. Nico might be behind. Nico went out. Even Trich. Oh, he saved it again. Out of the four saves against the Dynamo last week in the nil-nil draw, three stupendous ones, of course. Do you have a favorite? Yeah, the, the last one is my favorite. This was, it was the, the hard one. It's flicked on. Oh, even Trich again. What a game he has had. When you go back and look at the tape, do you, how much do you look at that? You go, that was pretty good. It was pretty good, but, you know, I move forward. After the mistake or after a good save, I don't think about it anymore. It's behind me. I'm, I'm just looking forward. Oh, Van Rankin, terrible giveaway. You saved not only road point, you saved a lot of goals. Saved by Ivacic. Big bailout from the keeper. You saved uh, Van Rankin once, if not twice. Does he owe you dinner or something like that? <laughs> yeah, yeah. We didn't talk about it, but... Uh, he will play usually breakfast. We go and we have breakfast together with, with Van Rankin and his wife. So he will pay for it for sure. <laughs> How about having uh, Bill Tuiloma, Larry Smalviala back in front of you as well. Both those guys back here and healthy and feeling good. Those are big bodies. And your work is made easier most of the times with those guys in front of you. Can you speak to how that is to have those two dogs in front of you? Yeah, it's good to have them. I mean, we really have uh, good center backs. All four, they're amazing. Whoever plays, we are in a good place for sure. And they make it uh, easier for me, uh, that's for sure. You're a humble guy. Saw you in the post-game show. You don't want to talk about yourself and your saves much. Where did that come from? Uh, I've all been, always been like that, I don't know. I believe in hard work and uh, I don't want to be too emotional after the good game because if you are too emotional after the good game, the same is going to happen, happen after the bad game. I don't want to be too emotional or to get too crazy after a good game because the next one is coming and you have to prove yourself again and again and again. You guys have the PTFC for Peace match coming up after this home game, of course, on Wednesday. And you guys are all going to be involved. Timbers and Thorns mixed. That's going to be fun to play a co-ed match. How important is that to you, though, to do what you can here as a MLS professional soccer player from across the globe to help those families and kids that have had to flee their home in Ukraine or, or who knows what they come back to if they ever can? What's your role in that? Yeah, uh, it's it's amazing to have opportunity like that to play, to play a game like that. You know, having fun and at the same time to do something good for them. It's it's really it's a good feeling. That you're doing something good for them, and it's hard to imagine how how do they feel. I mean, we are countries around them. We are all hoping it's not gonna get to our country. So it's I can't even imagine how is it for them. So I'm really glad that we can help them in some way.